lying on that husband bed, breathing with the help of an oxygen. My husband did not open his eyes to see me. Let alone say the word to me is newly very way. Good happiness. Is it Albert? I wish you were there to see things for yourself. Ah. These doctors are always playing with one's emotion. I don't trust them at all. said now. Are you implying my husband is going to die? Is that what you're saying? Not ready. It will be served in less than 10 minutes. Make sure you're fast about it because I'm famished. As it pleases you, Your Majesty. My king, do you think the doctor told us the truth? I don't understand. But do you think there's any reason for him to lie to us? He might not want to hurt us by telling us the truth. Why do you think so? He knows that Frank is our only child. Besides, the presence of Princess Jane, his newly married wife, could be a good reason for the doctor not to tell us the true situation of things. My queen, every medical doctor is expected to say the truth about the health condition of any patient under their care. So, I see no reason the doctor has to lie to us. Your Majesty, my husband, I don't know. I don't just know why my mind is telling me something else. I greet you, Your Highness. King Chinedu Njoku. There's the Gumba the second of our great kingdom. Greetings to you too, Anadike. The eyes of the gods. The gods you sent to my shrine said I am needed here urgently. And I ask, is everything all right, my king? Everything is not all right, Anadike. The queen and I no longer sleep at night. What is going on? <laughs> Honestly, I am lost at that, your majesty. What on earth could it be that could smash? To sleep from the eyes of my king and his precious queen? What, what? What? I reported to you the case of my son a few days ago. And you said you would consult the girls and get back to me. And my son's condition is not really improving. What are the gods saying? The gods have not said anything yet. Does that mean the prince will remain like that? Can something be done? Your Majesty, how we shall have answers to your question. Your Majesty, what does it mean by that? How can he open his mouth and say the gods have not said anything? Why on earth would the gods not say anything? I really do not understand what is going on in here. 
Your Majesty, we have to do something really fast. We can't allow our son to die. May the gods forbid. Nothing will happen to him. My son will come back alive. Yes, he will come back alive. We must do something to make him come back alive. Yes. What exactly do you think we have to do to get him out of this present condition and bring him back home? My love, you have to try to eat something, no matter how little it is. You would definitely walk with your legs again. Your father, the king, is making serious arrangements to fly you abroad for proper treatment. I love. I promise to stand by you through thick and thin. You are my husband, and I love you so much. Please, eat something. Please, okay. My love, please. Is this how you want to continue to the very end? to be in this type of pain. But marriage is for better for us. That was then, my dear. Listen to me. The prince never liked you. He only married you because his father said he must do so. Pat, must you remind me of all that? Princess, how can a young girl like you live with a man that cannot perform in bed all the rest of your life? How? And what if they could not treat him? They are not God, remember? Can we leave my marriage and talk about something else? There you go again, trying to change the topic. Prince. Okay, it's alright. My daughter, how is your husband doing? He's fine. He's I know it has not been easy for you trying to take care of him in his present condition. But I want to thank you immensely for your effort. If I don't do it, who will do it for me? I'm only doing my work. I don't think anybody should thank me for it. You're not every woman who do what you're doing right now. Considering the circumstances surrounding this marriage, be a good woman. Thank you. It's my cross. I'll carry it. again I would like to thank you for your persevering spirit. His uh, medical trip abroad will be in two days time. So I want you to prepare him early enough. We'll just hope and pray that everything works out well. Okay. Yes.
Your <laughs> <laughs> Majesty will not stop. <laughs> I know why I'm married. Your Majesty? Yes. You did not for the check first. No, I didn't. So what is it in the palace by this time of the day? I am the king. The chief priest is free to see his king anytime. I don't think that is a problem. Greetings! A great king and queen of a giant Lolo kingdom. Greetings to you, Anyadike, the eyes of the gods. Greetings to you, eyes of the gods. What brings the eyes of the gods to the palace this hot afternoon? Indeed, the toad does not scamper in the daytime in vain. The gods have heard your cries. They have accepted your sacrifice. And finally, they have granted your request. May their name be praised. The prince, your son, will return to this land. But warn him to be very careful. Eyes of the gods, what should we be warning our son against? That the gods have not revealed to me. The message is, warn your son. Warn your son. Warn him to be very, very careful. Um, very well, thank you, my princess. And you? Fine. Okay. How, how is your husband, the prince, doing? Any news from him? He is fine. Exactly what you said even before you traveled. Princess, I don't understand. Does it mean they don't give you detailed information about his condition or what? All right. So, have they been able to tell you when he will be coming back? They have not said that to me. I just pray he comes back as soon as possible. <laughs> you know, his coming back is not even my problem. What bothers me is what his condition will be by the time he returns. <laughs> I can't wait to set my eyes on you again. The night is cold. I feel so lonely. Empty. I wish you were here to take away my loneliness. I miss you so much. Good evening, Your Highness. I'm fine, Your Highness. Did you say my husband will be back tomorrow? Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. 
world. What a beauty. Grab me out and you see me. The longer the time is here. drama you pulled out there. What's the problem? Jenny, what's the problem? You've come here to question me. Who do you think you are? I am your wife. I am your wife. To know why you choose to embarrass me in the presence of everyone. Why you choose to embarrass your pretty wife. A wife that you have not seen for a very long time. I don't see where this conversation is going. So I ask her to stop pushing me and just leave. What have I done wrong? Leave. Just, just leave me alone before I lose my mind. Okay, just, just go. You hear me? My husband, please calm down. He hasn't gotten up to this. Get out. What happened today? If, in fact, you needed to be there. Hmm. Okay. I know, dear dear. I know so what happened. You went there, dear. Tell me, make I know what happened. In fact, you still don't understand what I'm talking about. On the pause. On the pause. What in the world are you? Eh? Tell me, what in the world are you? You do always like your story, do long throat for person, and you know good. You know good. Now you're dead there. Tell me what thing you see. You know what? Tell me. And you get one thing about your life when I know like. What? You do always this stingy. Very, very stingy ways to lead it. I know like your life. See, see, Cosmos. I just I just wanted to make you feel Arab I understand what, what uh, Arab I only very fine, 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 fine. I will tell you. Oga pushed his wife away when she was trying to greet and hug him when he was coming down from the car. Got a fair bit. No, you made it. Pushed. What did happen? How did it happen? Is that question for me? Are you asking me? 
Am I the organ that pushed his wife away? <laughs> but Cosmos, you needed to be there. She needed to see how sexy this woman was looking. You needed to see how endowed, how packaged. Cosmos, Cosmos, oh God. You don't do, you don't do, you don't do. See, my Bible talker. See, anybody when they do this kind of thing, what you do now, now hellfire straight. You know, feel branch, even great person, you do go hellfire. And with the way where you just do this your hand like this, if you take me as take away and I know go agree. I know fit. Uh -huh. you, you say madam five for the clothes when she wear. If you say this Don't do it because of five five. Welcome, my son. I'm so happy you arrived your fatherland safely. Thank you, Dad. Thank you very much. Uh, but I can't even pretend that I'm not happy. You know, I was hoping to come back here and then find you and mom welcoming me, but uh, that didn't happen. Oh, you didn't inform me. Uh, yes, I know. The plan was actually to surprise everyone, including you and mom, but I guess that uh, plan didn't, didn't work out. My son, we tried to cancel our holiday here in Ghana, but we couldn't make it due to flight issues. Don't worry, we'll be back. Uh, it's okay. It's okay, Dad. Um, how is Mom, by the way? She's she's all right. She's resting at the poolside. side. All right, Dad. My warmest regards to her. All right, my son. See you, Celeste. Okay, Dad. See you. Dad. Your food is ready. Take off your clothes so you can go take your bath. Have a decent meal. Okay. I'll join you in the bathroom. I'm still willing to make you happy. I want to ask you a question, Jay. Go ahead, my friends. Are you a harlot? Beg your pardon. It's only a harlot who dresses half naked just to work on a husband to travel. And then have the entire community feast on a half nude body. So I ask you again, are you a harlot? Now I see. Was that why you embarrassed me out there today? You lack home training. You should get home training. Get it. I can't continue like this. I can't fake it anymore. 
Jane, wait, 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 wait. Like I used to tell you, marriage is not a bed of roses, you know. Please be calm. Things will be fine. Okay? It will be well again. Mother, you don't understand. What are you saying? Do you know you almost killed me last night? Oh, Jane. Please overlook things. Dina Munya Beneta, I don't care, Jaga. In a day, a rapple. And you just in everything. You know, go overlook, please. Mother, he has completely changed. He's now a total stranger. <laughs> Seeing your husband as a total stranger will just add to your problem. It will not help you at all. Please. You know, go. Jane, Jane, are you listening to me? Jane, is not picking her calls. Eh? What is really wrong with her? What is going on? I hope she's not planning anything stupid because I will not support any rubbish act from her. No. I will not support. I will never support. Here. Hey, Jane. Jane. Jane, you have to pick your call, no? You have to pick this call. I really need to talk to you. I want to talk to you. You need to pick my call. Huh? What is this? What is, what, what is all this? What is all this? I, I don't understand. What do you think you're doing? What does it look to you like I'm doing? Please, friend. I am leaving you for good. <laughs> Are you serious? <laughs> you're leaving me. Are you serious? In the next couple of days, you will realize if I am serious or not. Ah, uh, you should think this through. You will. Think. And I'll take an action that you're going to regret. What are you doing here with this bag? You have come to my house to stay. Mama, what are you talking about? Go back to your husband's house. That is where you belong. That's what I'm saying. I should go back to that beast. I'm not going anywhere. I won't go back there. The earlier you start going back to that house, the better for all of us. Nabakwao, Nabebi Sinata, Chevi Rebi Chelazo. That your only child should go back to a woman bitter. A man who nearly killed his wife over nothing. Am I even not talking? There's no way I'm going back to Frank. He's a devil. I'm not going back to you. And that same devil paid your bride price. Listen, Jane. That devil. Is your husband. 
Yes. And tradition makes it compulsory that you will live in that devil's house for the rest of your life. Oh yes. And you listen to me. Do not allow the king and the queen to hear that you left your husband's house for any reason. Because it is an abomination. Marriage is for better, for worse. You get that into your thing. Nonsense. She carry back come with me, not be me carry get to meet her. And that will give me a small. What you came back? Oh, what you thought I was going to come after you? Huh? Huh? You thought I was going to run after you? Looking for you. My name is Prince Frank. And I do not have time of the day to start chasing around useless and idiotic people like you. Hear me and hear me well, Jamie. Next time, pull this kind of stuff. Sweetheart. 
or come to my home. Hmm? Please, I want you to make yourself very comfortable by the time you visit. Okay. Okay? You have a beautiful home. Thank you very much. Um, so meet um, Tina, she's my sweetheart. I would like for you to make this house very comfortable for her whatever she visits. Alright? Um, I don't see the food on the dining table. Where is the food? Jen. Jen. The food. Hey! The food! I called you. And I'm hungry and I'm coming home with a guest. You agreed to make food. Where is the food? Can you hear anything I'm saying at all? Is there a problem I have with you? Why is the food not here? Huh? Why do we not have the food here? Can you please have the food? Please. Jay, I am talking to you. So we're going to stand here and move on ourselves all day. Okay. Now you see what I'm dealing with, right? I can see. Dealing with a total moron. Oh my God, this is beautiful. Be nice enough. Okay? To please. That way. Thank you very much. Can I have a tool? I have a guest. Sweetie. What? You didn't introduce me? Oh, 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 oh. sweetheart, my bad. Sorry. Um. Forgive my manners, darling. This is Tina, my sweetheart. Sweetheart, that is Jane. That's the wife they imposed on me as a crown prince. Oh. But not a problem. Um, time hmm? will take care of her. But it's okay, it's fine, it's fine. Choo -choo. Go, 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 go. It's fine. You can get the food now. We're really ready to eat. Please. What's your problem? Get the food! Go! You see what I'm dealing with? Can you watch me? I'm talking and then she stands there moping at me. Hey. You know what? Come to the daddy. She's not going to kill our appetite. You know? She knows how to cook. You know? I have to oh. give it to... Oh yeah, that's why I still... You know, keep her around here. She's a fantastic cook. You're gonna taste the food that you're gonna testify. Apart from that, she's totally useless. Please. I heard the prince and that lady 
making some funny sound. I heard, I heard the sound. It, it was real funny. I knocked. The prince came out. The prince came out half naked. But with the look on his face, I, I suspect something is happening. Something is going on inside that room as we speak. Something is happening. See your life. Like, you see, you, you use your two eyes. I heard how these two English take joy. You see, and I heard they join. So now come on here, you hear, you hear from, from, from background, you don't even see. Now you decide. So with what you heard, you, you are not able to fathom what probably may be going on inside that room. I'm just trying to make you understand. How do you go from what you hear, fathom the, 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 what kind of a person are you? What kind of a human being are you? My Bible talk and more. My Bible talk and say, no, they follow people when no holy, no associate with them. So because I came to tell you what I heard, that is why you think I am. Oh, good morning, princess. Good morning, How are you? I'm I'm fine, my princess. Uh, good morning. Uh, I hope so you pray for us. So I did. Uh, thank you, my princess. Have a nice Wait, you know Drive Princess Go Church? Oh! Oh! See your life? The people I said to drive, you know they're hungry again. You don't tire. Today, move something like this. Now you, wait to do get man job, don't tire. Between me and you, who is better now? Look at you, the gate is open. Wide open. The princess just walked in. Okay, what if now Robert enter now? Bro? Hmm? I'm with you. I wanted to take the princess to the church. But she said no, that she wants to use public transport. So what would you have me do? Yeah. Force her? Wait. You, 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 about the um, brother. Waiting today's date. Eh? Waiting be today's date. Which month today? Uh today's date. Now March. Now March April. Yeah, March, I'm they come to us the same I want to come. What? Uh, what do you want to do? Uh, <laughs> huh? Baby, who's that again? Uh. Kill yourself over a man that has vowed to make life miserable for you. That same man is my husband, remember? You don't need to remind me of that. Let me ask you for how long do you intend to stay in this bin? I don't know. I don't know. But I feel like. Oh, what is, is crashing on me? That's exactly how I feel. I, 
can't even explain it. I feel so terrible. Mm. How do you mean? But my husband keeps getting worse by the day. She didn't ask you to leave the house. Could have been better. Princess, talk to me. What is it? Part. Hmm? My husband now brings women into our matrimonial home and he sleeps with them. Before me. What? Frank, what type of a man are you? What type of a father will you be to your children when you finally become one? Mom, you're going around in circles now. It would be nice if you just, you know, get straight to the point. Tell me what exactly you're talking about because I'm still lost. Frank. Mom. If your children grow up and start bringing women into their matrimonial homes, what will you tell them? As a father, as a man you are now, what will you tell your own children? Mom, I don't, I don't get you. Are you implying that I'm irresponsible? Sure you are. How dare you bring another woman into your own matrimonial home? Have you forgotten you're married? That your wife suffered so much to take care of you while you were sick. Is that how to show her gratitude? Mom, you people who went to me into my regard. Really? Yes. Next time I get such a report about you, you won't like my actions. You won't like what I would do to you. I bet you, you won't like it. Thank you, baby. I can take anything from a man, but certainly not in sleeping with another woman before me. Especially when the man involved is my husband. Is your said. What do I do? Tell me. Don't tell me you don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Obviously, I don't know what to do because I'm very confused. The worst thing that can happen to anyone in your state right now is being confused. Listen to me, you must rise up to the occasion. If you keep quiet, you will lose this fight. Did you say fight? Yes, fight. You must fight for what is yours or get ready to lose it completely. Oh, 
please, can you just cut out the pretense? What did you... You know what? I don't even care. This would be the last time you would run off to my mother to go report me. You and I are meant to be man and wife. Whatever happens here stays here. Do you understand me? I don't think that you can manipulate me into telling me what happens in my house. It is my house, my room. So when I say jump, you ask me, sir, how high? All right? Stop running off to go and report me. This childish. Grow up. Can I help you? So, you're the bitch that wants to snatch my friend's husband and send her out of her matrimonial home. Who is talking? Oh, it's you. Listen, if you ever call me names again, if you ever call me names again, You forever regret it. <laughs> I'm still talking to you. Do I in any way look like the princess to you? And you listen to me. If you try me, I will bury you alive. Stay away from Prince Frank. He is married. Do you understand? Who is talking? Who is talking? Oh, it's you. <laughs> Woo -hoo! Fucking dog. I do not have time for mad woman like you. Now get off my way, please. Did you just call me a mad woman? And did you just touch me? No, did you call me mad? Did you just touch me? Did you? Also, you are saying I did it. No, that's what you're saying. So if you didn't do it, then who, who, who did? Are you? Are you? Are you telling me? That my Tina is lying to me now. No, is that what you're saying? No, tell me. You're saying that Tina, Tina is lying to me? No, no, that's not what I'm saying. No, that is what you're implying. Please, you have to believe Believe what? Listen, the only thing I believe is that you and I are done. You hear me? Yes, yeah, that's what I believe. This marriage is over. Okay? I can't continue with this nonsense. You see this charade? That has been going on for quite some time. It's over. I can't even... Get the fuck out of my house! Get your hands off. Get! I said get the back of my house! Are you, are you stupid? Ow! Ow! This nonsense is over. I'm done, alright? Make me sick in the stomach. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, put this down. You see, my mom's presence here is not going to change anything. You hear me? It's not going to change nothing. You're living and you're living for good. <laughs> <laughs> Interfering. 
Alright? You are interfering and I'm not going to accept it. I want to clear your head. I want to clear your head. Because I know you've lost it. Come inside. That one has to go, man. She has to go. We are done. This Stop is my house. This Stop is my house. We are done. She has to go. We are totally incompatible. She has to go. And that is final. Frank, I will never go back with you to the house again until she leaves. You cannot say that now, right? Please. I mean, we have plans. We, we, you and I plan to get married. Whatever happened to those plans? Come on. If you're really serious to get married to me, then divorce her. Send her out of that house. <sighs> Look, it's not that. Uh, it's not as easy as you think. To give me some time. Please. Then let me be. I am not a desperate lady. This is your house. Therefore, you should not allow any woman to come to your house and intimidate you. I've heard what she said, Queen Mother. I don't have strength for troubles. I don't want troubles. Why do you keep running away from trouble? It's when you keep running away from trouble or whatever that is chasing after you, it will keep coming after you. But once you decide and become brave to fight what is facing you, you will see it's running away from you. Jane, stand up and fight for your right. Frank is your right. This house is your house. That's the problem. I don't want to fight. I don't want to fight. Nothing good comes That I can assure you. Please, don't tell the king about what happened here today. I know him very well. If you tell him, you will not take it lightly with him. I don't want him to be having issues because of me. Please. Why do you want me to make such a promise to you? And don't you think telling the king about this will change the situation once and for all? Please, please don't tell him, please, I beg you. Please, don't tell him. Jen, can I go home? Excuse me. My princess, why is your face like this? What is wrong with you? What kind of a friend are you? Oh, tell me. What kind of a friend are you? Huh? The very one that loves, cares, and wants the best for a friend. Not even. You want my marriage to collapse, right? You beg your pardon. Pardon. Why did you have to go fighting my husband's mistress? Is that in any way your business? Is it? Yes, it is my business. It is my business because you cannot fight for yourself. And if I leave you, that bitch will send you out of that marriage. Pardon. My princess. God has given people like us the strength to fight for the weak ones like you. But what princess? Calm down, my princess. Huh? Just calm down, let me get you something to cool off it. This is certainly not what you need right now. Huh? You need to that. My princess. Calm down. Come down, let me get you something. My 
Honey. Honey, food is ready. I was waiting for you to come join me inside. Honey, I'm so Stay with me. What were you trying to do? Slap me? Did you just... <laughs> Frank. <laughs> don't you ever think about it. Let alone raising your hands on me. Don't. Don't try it again. You must have eaten something while I was asleep because you have grown wings, Jenny. Uh, <laughs> Let this be the very last time you will try that rubbish again. Jenny, I'll talk about that thing. Huh? I was going to tell you that I'll be going to my father's place today. Um, Myself and the king will have a meeting for praying very hard. But that meeting has nothing to do with you. Because if it does, when I come back to this house, you'll find that this house will be too small for you. Pray very hard. Tell me, I'll be right in this house waiting for you to come back. Dramatic. I don't want to die before my time. Besides, Prince Frank is not the only man on earth. I just don't want to believe you're a coward. What kind of useless statement did you just make? I'm very sad. I had no water in my mouth when I said it. So, why do you want to run away from your marriage? Do you even know how difficult it is to get a husband these days? <laughs> I'd rather remain single than to be in that hell called marriage. Then I don't want God or your mother to see me as part of the people that made you abandon your marriage. <laughs> I heard you. Dear friend, but I only beg you to please permit me to spend just this night. And by tomorrow, I'm gone. But if you will not, please tell me now so that I can go. Because my mind is made up. Hello, Dad. How are you doing? I'm fine, thank you, Dad. How is Mom? We are doing good. Is your wife close to you there? I want to speak with her. Oh, she's just not around, Dad. Well, she, she left the house yesterday. What are you saying? You are joking, right? Dad, I'm serious. She left the house yesterday. She so never returned. Dad, I'm sorry. I just, you know, she just packed up and left, and I thought that she was going to return at her own time. So, you know, but I'm, I'm sorry, Dad. You better go and look for her. Dad? What is wrong with this man? Really? Yes. Who are you talking about? My father, the king. Wants to know where Jane is. Was that why he called? Yeah. Are you a guy in jail? Ask me again. I don't know what it is with my parents and this girl. When I have you here, babe. Sweetie, you know what? Uh, make me happy. Please do not let them spoil this beautiful moment of ours. They can't. Forget them. 
I just look at your beautiful face and I lose my mind, baby. Really? <laughs> I'd love to kiss you. Can I just kiss you? Oh, come get it to me, baby. Just this one time. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Your Majesty, what would you like to have for lunch? On the beyond we do, with the busy soup. As it pleases Your Majesty. Woman, I believe that your son has gone mad. In fact, he has gone mad. Your Majesty, how do you mean? How can a sane man not know the whereabouts of his wife since yesterday? And he's yet to do something about it. Your Majesty, are you saying that Jane is missing? Going by what your son said, yes. Are you sure our son has not thrown out of the house? He should better pray that such a thing didn't happen. Else, he'll regret ever having me as a father. The many a pimp that calls himself my son. Yeah. Frank! Yeah, yeah, yeah. Come here. What is it? What's going on? Why did you send your wife out of the house? I didn't send Jane out of the house. I wouldn't do a thing like that. Dad. Why? You better find her or get ready to face my rot. Because of this prostitute, you sent away your wife from this house. We shall see. And what exactly is it that he needs to think? Why are you shouting? What what is this for? Oh, sweetie, come off it. Stop deceiving yourself. Your parents know the truth. Yes, she slept in my house, but she left the following day. She left the following day to where? I don't know. Just that we had an argument after she told me she was quitting her marriage. And I told her I'd only allowed to stay in my house for just that night. And, and what happened next? Nothing. Nothing happened. But she, she left the following day without telling me where she was heading to. And you just allowed her to live like that? But you allowed my daughter leave your house without telling you her whereabouts. Just pray that she's safe wherever she is. Pray that I find her. Because if I don't, hey, but if I don't, I am telling you that I, Beatrice, I will do the impossible. This town will not contain both of us. I am telling you the truth. You will know the best side of me. In fact, the best side of me you will see. Baby, this place is beautiful. Hello. Oh, oh. Your parents have eyes for good things. Oh, I love it. You do? I do. <laughs> Money. Huh? This is what money can do. You can say that again. <laughs> but don't forget that not every wealthy person have high so good things. Uh, well, that one is true. Uh, but my parents, they've got eyes for good things. I know. Gosh. Quite exposed. Look at these. Well traveled. Oh, 
you can mom. What is this cheap harlot doing in my house? Eh? Hey, who opened my gate for you? Eh, good, 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 good. Frank, mom. take this idiot out of my house before I lose my temper. Eh? Shoo, shoo. Hey, leave! Hey, get out! Eh? Leave! Want me to smack you? Leave. Wait outside. Just leave it outside. She's dressed like a jeep hall. Uh, mom, it's fine. Did you get up? Mom, calm down. I'm sorry. Eh? I'm sorry, mom. So what do you want? Uh, you see, mom, I've come to appeal to you to help me talk to that. Let him know that I didn't ask Jane to leave the house. I mean, she just... So what do you want? I've just told you what I want, to help me talk to that. Listen. The earlier you bring back Jane, you wife into your house, the better for you and for everyone. I think you're missing the point, Mom. This woman got up and left. I didn't ask her to leave. Your father back any moment from now. Trust me, you will not find it funny if he finds you here. Ah! Tell me, what did I do to your parents? That he hates me with so much passion. I don't think they hate you. Huh? What did I hear you say? Frank, they insult me. They call me all sorts of names. Your mother walked out of the palace after insulting me. And you sit down there to tell me you don't think they hate me? Really? I think that all that stems from the fact that What is that? And how is that a problem? Who tell me? How is that their problem? Tina, we should take a break. Yeah, I, I need some time to myself. I, I need to find my wife and bring her back home. Please. What did you just say? <laughs> you will do no such thing. Why? Do you know why? I mean, look at this. This this madness is not taking us out of We're not making progress. Why? <laughs> I'm a married man. Let me be. Oh, you are a married man. I should be let you be, Mister Man. Do I need to remind you? That we took an oath. Hmm? Let us sink into your brain. Mr. Eric, you're welcome. How are you doing today? I'm doing fine. I'm okay. I'm doing very great. I'm sorry I couldn't make it past shadow. No, it's okay. At least you're here now. So how are you doing? Oh, for that, she's okay. But the injury she sustained is much as you know. But she's supposed to be responding to treatment by now. I don't get you, doctor. Why is she not responding to treatment then? Uh, the whole thing is very confusing to me. Doctor, you cannot use the word confusing. You're a medical doctor. You should find a solution to this. What actually do you want us to do right now? I don't want to put the scene as a model. Do everything within your power to make sure that she's okay. I can do something. Mr. Eric, I wish I know what to say. So you see, sweetheart, do not do what you will live to regret. Do not let your parents lead you to destruction. Do I? Uh, what do I do? This, this is crazy. Tina, please, help me if you can. Please, just help me. What do you do? What's that supposed to mean? Are you asking me such question? Huh? You're threatening me. My father, the king, is threatening to disown me. My wife is missing. Right now, I'm in the middle of nowhere. I don't know what to do. Just, I need help. 
If you can help me, just help me. Don't be so mean, please. Mr. Man, you brought this to yourself. Clean your knees. No. Anadike, what's the message from the gods? The gods are silent. Why are they always silent? Why can't they speak to you? Now we all need them to talk. Anyadike, I personally came to the shrine and offered a very big sacrifice concerning this issue. Didn't they accept my sacrifice? Your Majesty, the gods accepted your sacrifice. Then why have they not been able to tell you where my son's wife is? Why have they not been able to reveal to you why my son is behaving this way? Why? Patience. 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 Caution is the key word. What is the meaning of that? And then they can tell the gods to rise up to the occasion. Tell them! The royal house must be mindful of what they say and how they say it, to avoid attracting the wrath of the gods. Nonsense. This nonsense has to stop. I am tired of seeing this shit in this house. Nonsense. How many you think I will sit down here and watch this rubbish in, in, in that house? Nonsense. Rubbish. So what is this now? What is this? Why are you doing? Do you do you know the implication of what you just done? How many times have I warned you to take this 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 rub this rubbish out of this house? How many times have I warned you? Ah, you're a mad woman. That's what you are. You are mad. You are you are you are mad. Frank, you called me a mad woman. <laughs> you have not seen madness yet. You have not seen madness yet. Rubbish. Take this thing out of this house. Why, why have you come into my life to complicate it? Tina, what did I ever do to you in this world? What have I done to you? Why are you constantly looking for ways to make life difficult for me? Is it a wrong thing that I saw you, liked you, brought you into my life? Am I me for a joke? Ah, please shut up! She belongs to your past! You don't know the queen sweet face at Piccolo. The one you brought upon yourself, she belongs to your past! She can't have the queen sweet face. Hey! What is this? What have I gotten myself into? The outside. God, I beg you! To see the beautiful one you have inside. You keep looking, searching on the outside. When you have what you need and want <laughs> You'll buy it for me <laughs> I want this to be dead type It's right in front of you But you don't see it Sometimes what you really want It's right there in Excuse front me, I'll call you back, okay? But you fail to see on me. it the grass is greener on the outside. My in-law, you're looking so beautiful. How are you people? Are you? You don't even want to say hello to me. Everybody. My people. <laughs> they will so forget that you people are royalty. They will also forget the smooth and sweet relationship that has existed between us and make serious trouble with you people. My in-law, what is, what is the problem? I don't like the sound of that at all. Is there anything the matter? Grace tears. Grace tears. Why are you sounding as if you don't understand what I'm talking about. As if you don't 
not the direction I am coming from. Why? My in law, please. I am completely and totally confused. I am lost here. Talk to me in the language I will understand. Make me understand. I see. <laughs> Actually, you are lost. You are totally lost. Why has your son decided to play with the only thing that matters to me in this world? The only thing that adds meaning into my life. Oh, Jane, oh, my in-law, I am sorry. Don't be angry with us. We are at the top of the matter. We are making effort. When we find her, just calm down. Just give us time. She'll be found. Right? You will find her. Mm -hmm. Very soon. Soon? <laughs> when? I hope your son has not used my daughter for money rituals. So he can enjoy it with that harlot I saw him with today. I hope. I hope. Have you been able to talk uh, with your son-in-law or anyone from the royal home about this? Yes, but they are not saying or doing anything to find her. DPO, I think the priests have used my daughter for money ritual. Madam, what? why would you say such a thing? Of course, you know the prince is from a wealthy home. Therefore, he cannot soil his hands with the blood of his own wife. You don't know the children of nowadays. They are very desperate. I don't trust the prince. He can do the unthinkable. Oh. This is a strong allegation. Come to the station immediately. front of you but you don't see it decided to drag the name of this royal family to the mud. What are you? You sound angry. What is your problem? <laughs> what is this harlot still doing in your house when your wife is out there missing? Oh, well, Dad, uh, <laughs> uh, let me explain to you. You see, Jane um, is not particularly the woman that I want to live with as a married man. Uh, this is the one that I want, and her name is Tina. Dad. Um, her name is not Harlot. I, I should... How dare you talk to me like that? How dare you? <sighs> All right, Dad, I get it. Okay, I, I see your point, I understand. But I would appreciate it if you stop prying into my personal offense, please. With all due respect, Father, please. Please. Try not to pry into my personal life. You will so regret this very day. Get me out of here! Don't see it. 
What are you looking at? Fool! That will come up from Igwe hand, go up, come down. Now slap, that is not my problem. My problem is the prince. I might Igwe that slap him. Sometimes I don't, I don't understand the prince. Igwe na mokura. Prince Frank. Did you use your wife, Princess Jane, for money rituals? <laughs> <laughs> Your question is preposterous. Why? Why would I use my wife for rituals? You are not expected to ask me questions. Rather, you're here to answer my questions. Now I ask again. Did you use Princess Jane, your wife, for money ritual? I did not use my wife for money rituals. So tell me. Why haven't you done something meaningful? Since she was reported missing. Who says? I have been doing everything meaningful, all to no avail. Isn't that why I'm here? You're looking for her, looking for her. Everyone is looking for her. Hmm? Prince Frank, there is a petition against you that you used your wife for money rituals. You know the meaning of that, right? <laughs> Uh, I'm in your office now, and my wife is missing. Well, what can you do for me? I need your help. I have a wife who's out there. I don't know what's happening to her, her whereabouts. Can we not get into the bureaucracy of the petition and justify my wife, please? Tell me what it would cost. I would pay. I would cover the expenses, but I need to get down. Sometimes what you really need is right in front of you, but you don't see it. Sometimes what you really want is right there in front of you, but you fail to see it. You think the grass is greener on the outside. What is that? Son, what is chasing after? Why are you bargaining here like something bigger than you is chasing after you? That what is still at home. Where have you kept her? What are you talking about? Oh, please, just stay out of this. That where is still at home. Get out of my sight, this place. Get out! Now, do you think that I'm here to joke? No, no, you think I'm here to joke? That I don't understand why you want to make trouble with me. What do you stand okay from this war that you want to start, father? Frank, are you alright? I'm alright, mom. Where is my woman? What have you all done to her? Where is she? Get out of this palace before I order the guards to deal with you. Get out! I see that you think that I am here. But I tell you this, I give you a 72 hour ultimatum. You do not provide my woman. I assure you, you are not going to like the look of the civil war we're about to start. Hey,
see you are buying me a food. I don't like people with that, that is. Why are you afraid of us? <laughs> Calm down, now you are buying me a food. No, no. Did you see all these guys? Yeah? They have a criminal in their heart. <laughs> so you are welcome to our world. We are be dead. You see what it is? Go. Please. Please. What do you want? What do you want? Who you are is none of your business. Eh? Mm. What we want from you, tell you when we need it. Eh? Shut up. Eh. Mm. I hate to see a pretty girl like you panic. What you should be talking about now is how to get yourself out from here. Mm. And you are panicking. Mm. Mm. So please. Please, sir. So please. I would do anything. Anything, look, please. So I could. Hey, listen. It is very simple. Very simple. Don't misbehave. Because if you try it, I swear. Okay. And don't even try to escape. Mm -hmm. I will do whatever you want to do. Oh, please don't kill me. No, 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 no. Don't kill me. I'm making noise here. See her. Your life is in our hands now. Yeah? You decide what will happen to your life. If you misbehave, go by me. I have no idea. Shut up! See her. Who go? See her. Make any noise here. You know where we did have it. Make any noise here. Yeah. Sit down well. Sit down well. Come here. Come here. Come, come close. Yeah. I don't know I don't know if 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 I Amanam, oh yeah, when me amanam, bam bam. God of Zerubbabel, eh, uh, uh, Jibis, uh, 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 Isaac, Baba Hum, Baba Hum, Arana Zomwa, Oje Abantu Mere Pelo, Oje Ugu Mere Vaita Fum, Baba. I find you come your house. Make me and you reason like father and son, like three men. Baba, you know say my madam lost. But why she lost and how she take loss, I don't know. Uh -huh. Before I forget, I say make her also thank you. As you make my sister madam, may she lost. Mm -hmm. That one good. Oluwa. I beg, I use all my family beg you. No ever, ever allow make uh, Madame Tina come back to Morgan House again in Jesus' name. Amen. People in some But my own Madame, just make me she come back to Morgan House. That one goes with me. You go with me. Because if you don't do one, if you don't do one, Baba. You no go sleep. Drop possible. As na any any water, go jump in water. We lay a kilo. I carry a roll with the tiara. If not to face you, talk and they make me feel like saying an insult. Make I bend my head. Oluwa, you no fit sleep. You must make my madam come back because now you talk for your book. You talk for your book for ne 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 ne. Before I have a cook, say when uh, Nebuchadnezzar the lock and with uh, Adam uh, lion, say now you break chain, Nebuchadnezzar come out, break that door where they used to my madam, make my madam come back, 
Now you still talk for book, for Bible say, that I went, Zebu, I'm not supposed to know. I didn't say that. I want to ask. What do you want us to do with that? Don't rush it. So we don't make mistakes. Yeah. For you guys, okay. Everyone should stay calm for now. Remember, no mistakes. Yeah, don't talk to your demand. Cosmos. Huh? Where are you coming from? I go to church to go pray. You went to church? Well, I understand that you don't love your job anymore. Right? Oh, maybe you've saved enough money. So that when you misbehave and they sack you, then you go and start up something. Am I correct? Which kind of stupid? Mm. You from church? Which kind of question can be this one? Cosmos, so this whole compound is not conducive for you to pray. Hey, Cosmos. Okay, no, look at this way. I don't dare here. Pray, oh, sete, I tire. My mother no really come back. I carry myself. Go meet God. Meet me and I'm risen face to face. For a house. About it, I do. You did well. Uh -huh. You did well. Clap for yourself. Then wait. When Oga comes back, you will explain to him. It's simple. Mama, any news? Hmm. 
Mm. The prince and his parents think that I am joking. But they will know the type of person I am when the time comes. They will do. They will know the type of person me, Beatrice, is when the time comes. Mama. Are you saying the time is not now? Because I can't keep being quiet over the disappearance of my friend. She is your friend. And I am her mother. So, what are you saying? Are you saying that I'm not doing what I am supposed to do to find my missing child? No, Mama. Not at all. Then relax and allow me to do my thing. Just to relax. You went away, Mo. Is the way when they may buy for Mo? Dude, you mean so I don't come back? I thought you said that all will happen. Why are you scared? Why are you, why are you fugitive? Eh? Don't worry, relax. When he comes back, both of you will settle. It's simple. This thing where you do no good. This thing where you do no good. If now your own, I go cover for you. But if you reach my own, you no go even agree to cover for me at all. Jude, there is God. Oh. I don't have your time, Cosmos. I don't. I don't have your time. Baba God. You know, say true, true. Now your house, I come. And as me and you sit down inside that church, the reason I know text and insult you, I know insult you anywhere. Can I just ask you one more thing? He said, my guy, if you return, I beg you. Do I may become Mumu? So that you don't ever remember to ask me anything for this compound. Cosmos. Thank you for taking me to that party. I thoroughly enjoyed myself. I know you will. I've never been to such a party before. I took out their house. Oh. Beautiful! I know. I know. What That class? is just an epitome of this. That's a lie. Can't see that again. Miles. The press is here. He's there with some policemen. They want to see you. My son. The press is here with some policemen. Yes, To see me. What for? Uh, to be honest, I don't know. But from what I heard the prince say, they, they, they want to arrest you. What? <laughs> arrest me? Yes, Your Highness. Take me to them. I don't understand. You mean she's still alive? Yes, she's still alive. But her condition is not good. Baba, what do you mean by that? What is that look on your face? Baba, have you forgotten it is my daughter we are talking about here? I need to know what is happening to her. <laughs> you demanded for it to happen. Now it is happening. You do not need to worry. We are still in control. Oh, 
How dare you disobey me? <laughs> huh? I am very sorry. Huh? Come on, come on. Shut up! Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> you love praises. I don't use praise come meet you. Because now you because of uh, people when don't sing it the past when give glory to your name. People like uh, uh, God of um, Helene Nkume. Uh, people like uh, God of Chinyeru uh, Doma. People like uh, God of Gozi uh, Okeke. People like uh, uh, God of uh, uh, Desmond, my husband Desmond, Chuku uh, Mabiyama. All of them give you praises. I don't use praises come meet you. Baba, why you don't go make my madam come back? Eh? Why you don't go make my madam come back? You good? When I know say for this country, People they steal money, now so they find money lost. How many million naira? Now so they find and find and find and go see for one man house. They recover them. No, only you make they recover them. No matter say we don't know what they use and do let out. They don't tell us. You know say where news they stop now where they find the money. News go caught. Baba, another people when lost money accuse your your innocent innocent serpent. Say that python swallow the money. When I still make us find them inside python belly. Cast the loss, house the loss, money the loss. They they see him. They come be my common princess. Come on, <laughs> my princess, my princess, madam. Loss. God, if they don't say, I go be like say your CCTV. You know they work now. Nah. Eh? I beg, if not, just I don't say inside engines. You get the one when the two work. Eh, eh, which this engine? Eh, engine. Eh, Fino, uh, 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 Rafael, <laughs> and Rafael, that one we like to find. Hey, she make him to only on a panel where make him get Make him come search my madam, bring and come back. To see the other angel. What do you really want from the wife of the prince of the general kingdom? And no one else is feeding you with that rubbish. Does it really matter? The important question here is why did you lie to me? I am. I am sorry I lied. But trust me, it's not what you think. What way will you look like a fool? I just said I am sorry. For being sorry, you will pay me 20 million naira cash. Where do you want me to get that kind of money from? I believe that the prince will be glad to know that you ordered the kidnap of his wife. I need my money. If I look for the money, I didn't see the money. The war will happen. What the people will be from hazard. Yes. 
What do you want? Nothing. Is this your duty post now? So why are you here? Uh, okay. Madam, don't come back. What? The princess is back. Where is she? How come I didn't hear her come? Where, where, where is she? Okay, now for three months, I see her come back. I said, I woke up, I said, I can't ask. My prince, my madam, Princess Jen, you should not come back. me a kidnapper. Do you know I would have gone into a very serious mess if not that I am a man of the people and with connection? Forgive him, you said. Your Majesty, you need to forgive your son. Please forgive him. Biko, he's our son, our only child. Besides, he's the heir apparent to your throne. You cannot change that. Says who? Listen to me. Do you know I can decide to disown him and let someone else sit on that throne? No, you cannot do that. Please forgive him. Has not gotten to that. You go. Over my dead body. Your Highness! You will not die yet. Because my daughter is missing. Tell your ritualist officer to bring back my daughter. Else, you people will not like what I will do. salt. If you ever had a daughter, you will know what it means to lose one. I want you, bring back my daughter. Bring back my daughter. And you listen. This will be my last peaceful visit to this place. Excuse me. Now, did you hear that? Did you see that? Tell your son to get ready for me. Guys, I don't think this place is still secured for us. How do you mean? Uh, yes, um, <clears throat> Hazard. I mean, we've been using that place for quite a long time now. Uh, why are you standing this way? I hope there is no problem. See, in this kind of business, one needs to be very smart and intelligent at the same time. If not, be a lady. Uh, you're right. Absolutely right. But uh, you haven't still answered our question. Simple. <laughs> I met with Pat today. I don't like the way she sounded. I said stop. <laughs> I, I still don't understand what you're talking about. What kind of trouble are you talking about? Oh, God, trouble is trouble. You said over six. Okay. Hey. Hey. 
Now I'm convinced that the prince is in a big mess. Hey. Oh. Hey. Mm. Now today you know. No, now today you know. You see this one so. This one where you enter. It big past mess. This one a big shit. Big shit don't be say if you bring me three, bring you two. We join her together. Now big shit. Now you enter so. What does this why? Why? Why would the prince allow himself get into such trouble? Ah, Arla bai. Arla bai. Why you go ask me this kind of question? You see now, eh? if you pass pass that black door, eh? Yeah. Go straight. Yeah. Eh? Yeah. You see, the other side, the yeah. girl like wear staircase there now. Yeah. Uh -huh. Clamp them up. Yeah. The first big door went fine by the left. Nadia or Gade. Go ask him. You're very stupid. Go ask him. What kind of nonsense did he ask me like that? You're very stupid for saying that. You are very stupid. You're an idiot. You are Jamvori. You are Ipunani. Don't come like you. Ipotoria Guinea. Damn you. Very stupid. Make I tell you. You see this one where you enter so? <laughs> Not be anything. You call him part one. The one where you go enter. Next one where you go enter. Now the part two. Part! Mind what you see me. Ha. Well, anyway, since we are, we are no longer going out, let me use this opportunity to tidy my clothes. I don't want to hear that again. What then do you want to hear? I want to hear something positive. Anyadike will never speak when the gods have not spoken. Anyadike, the royal family is facing a very big problem as we speak. And that may destroy the entire kingdom if nothing is done about it. I need a solution as soon as possible. I pray the gods will look into your heart and provide a solution as soon as possible. Are you saying you cannot do anything right now? And the queen of this kingdom knows very, very well that the chief priest will never speak when the gods have not spoken. Else, the gods will strike him dead. Or, does the queen want the chief priest dead? Hazard! Your game is off! Drop your weapon! Your hands above your head! Walk out of the house one after the other! This building is seriously surrounded by my boys! Drop your weapons! I repeat! Drop your weapons! Hazard, I repeat! Drop your weapon! Your hands above your head! Walk out of the house, one after the other! This house is seriously surrounded by my men! What is the problem? Don't tell me the boys escaped. Sir, I went in there, I didn't see anybody. Are you sure of what you're telling me? Yes, sir. How then did you say you got the letter? Sir, I found the letter on top of the driver's seat of that van. Let's begin immediately. Yes, follow sir. me, follow me. <laughs> Look at them. Stupid men. So you think you can just come and get us like that? Shimei. Hmm.
What is the meaning of that nonsense you displayed over there? I don't understand. What exactly are you so talking you go about? You're between people, right? I said, I don't understand. Why are you sounding this way? I mean, what did I do? Listen. Tell those idiots they sent to me not to try that again. If they try it again, I'll go them down. Bring my money to me. I will not want you again. You know who I am. I am Hazard. I will get mental. down. can't blame me for going that far, Mom. You know how Father hates that girl with a passion. Do I like her? Oh, you don't, but you're quite civil in the way you do, you, 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 you do things. Oh, you see, the, 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 the way he harasses the girl all the time. But that's not why I'm here. Here so that you can help me talk to him. Me talk to him? No, because you know how difficult your father can be. I, I know, but you're the queen. You're, the, you're, you're his wife. He listens to you. What is that stupid boy doing here? Frank. I am all. Just what is that? Why am I Why am I supposed to be Why are you doing this? Am I supposed to be Go ahead with that void drop. I said, what is that stupid boy doing here? Eh? Where are you running to? No, come back! Come back and face me. Come back and talk to me. Prince Frank. Prince Frank. You think you're a man. Nonsense. I find it very difficult to, to understand this. Why this sudden change of profession? From a gitman to a pastor? What happened? Yeah? Gitman pastor. <laughs> I know there's nothing to tell you. Yeah? But wait until my God will endeavor answer my prayer. Because I know he will answer my prayer. Amen. Amen. But it's obvious you're wasting your precious time. Hmm. Yes, you're wasting your time. You've been praying for a very long time now, yet no result. Do you think a sinner like you is in the position to do this? Cosmos, listen and listen very good. The day you will lose this job. Cosmos, the day you will lose this Gitman job. That is the very day you will realize how stupid and foolish you are. Continue. No problem, continue. I'm not going to tell you anything now. Make I just wait until my madam, Jen, come back. If I get talk, I go tell you. But for now, the only good thing will be for me. Cover me, my God, break it, my God. I'm not covering you. Just pray on that does not accept me. I'm not covering you for anything. Pass me. Remember this. Right now. Hello? 
okay, 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 I'm, I'm listening. I'm, I'm, I'm listening, sir. I'm, I'm listening. Yeah, but, but I want to see her. I mean, we're all agitated. We, we, we have to see her. I have, I have to find her. You can just send me her. Okay, okay, okay. Yes, yes. Yes. All right. I'll, 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 I'll do as you said. Hello, sir. Can I? Hello? Who was that? Sorry. What did you say? <sighs> Out of this, leave the police out of this. We can't do the police. You get the police involved, it gets tricky. I know how these things turn out, it gets tricky. Please, I beg you, in the name of everything that you hold sacred, just leave the police out of this. So, how much do we ask for? I think 10 million. Yeah, 10 million. So I, I can have 3 million. We have 3 million. And we can now give uh, 4 million to the ball. Okay. <laughs> so um, I, I so much in support of that. Uh -huh. uh, we should remember that we are talking of Prince Frank Joko. The son of Ugumba II of Ejalolo's kingdom. That is the very reason why you should pay us 30 million. <laughs> exactly. Or no deal. Because I believe he's a prince. Uh, he has money. Yes. And we need money. So he, he has to pay us money. And he's going to give us money. 30 million, no deal. No deal. Now if it comes now, we still talk now with the food or not. No. Uh, you can see her. See that girl. Hazard once to double cross me. A boy I picked up from the streets and taught how to survive even when there was no hope. How do I sit back and allow this boy go away with 30 million naira? In a deal I arranged. <laughs> Hazard. I can see you now a big boy. Get ready for the battle. I don't want to be engaged in any discussion that has to do with that useless boy. Your Majesty, he still remains your servant. The heir apparent to your throne. You really need to forgive him. Why will I do that? 
because he's really sorry for what he did. I never disrespected my parents, let alone arresting them. Your son will definitely catch my rod. Your Majesty, I understand how you feel. But you see, this... You know... This discussion is over. Driver, take me out of here. Inspector John. Sir. Get the van closer. We are moving these dead bodies right away. Okay, sir. Fast. Well, good afternoon. So you left your duty post. Eh? Huh? Cosmos. Hmm? You left your duty post. Oh God, no be ordinary come out, I come out. Now pray, go pray. You want to pray? As what? As the Pope? <clears throat> huh? Cosmos? Hmm? Oh, oh God, no. It is clear enough that you are beginning to take your job here for granted. You are pushing me. You are pushing me. You are, you are pushing me. What cannot be ordinary prayer? Keep quiet! Hello? Yes, DPO, I, I, I can hear you. What? You found my wife? Where, where is she at the, at the moment? How can I see her? What? I, yes! At the police station? Oh, okay, I, I, I'll, I'll, I'll be with you right away. Okay, I talk and say no be ordinary prayer. Will you keep quiet! I don't put the gate for me. No problem, sir. Station. Which side they see, Amor? Sometimes what you really need is right in front of you, but you don't see it. Sometimes what you really want It's right there in front of you But you fail to see it You think the grass is greener on the outside And fail to see the beautiful one you have inside Hey! I shall die I don't know I know that you'll find Hannah for Bible And see where you take fire my madam now you find Abraham when he lost. Let's say you go find my <laughs> Hazard. What a surprise. I thought I was dead. What? What do you mean by that? This is the young lady. I hate when you pretend. I know that I am hazard. What exactly are you talking about? You're getting me confused. See, the blood of my comrades are going to Are you accusing me of having a hand in their death? Thank God. Uh, 
What kind of a dream is this? Could it be that any of these boys escaped? Hmm. I was told the police killed all of them. Hazard, you cannot scare me. The living and the dead have nothing in common. Stupidities are over. I do not want to hear that you left your duty post unless I or my husband sent you out. Listen, anytime you want to pray, since you have not turned an overnight priest, do it in your room or your duty post. Do I make myself clear? Hmm? If you want to pray, do it in your room or your duty post. What did I say? Madam, I declare if you want to pray, do it for your uh, room, uh, your duty post, or uh, where, where, where. Are you mad? Uh, do you think I'm praying here? I said, what did I say? Now listen. Anytime you decide to pray, do it in your room or your duty post. Hmm? If you try that during working hours, <laughs> you will see the other side of it. Don't make myself clear. Very clear. Good. But, madam, I. I, I... Shut up your mouth! Get out of here! I'm done with you. Hey, oh God, 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 why are you like this? Eh? Why are you there like this? I know as if the three others went on die before me. Eh? See, Pharaoh, them, all these people, you allow them, they come heaven before you give them their punishment. Why you go bring my uncle meet, meet me for earth when I see the walk that life? Eh? Eh? Pray why the pray give you. God. I, I, I know side here say you get mind. But I don't know say you reach like this. Why you go get mind do me this content? Eh? You talk say you no go give us snack when we say now fish we ask you of. Now you still carry Moses' hand. Write for another of your book. Say you no go carry Okripo stone. Give us when we say now bread we ask you of. Oh, go do now century twenty one more snail. Snail. Say you no go give us ordinary thing if no be that bread. Why you can't get my do me this kind of thing? Eh? No be you talk. Me and you sit down. We listen and one on one like real men. I pray, pray. Tell you, say, make you bring my madam, Princess Jen, come back. You go, go, come pray as when I pray, give you. Why are you shinana? Go bring this Jezebel. Bring, come back, Madam Tina. Come carry and come back again. I know now you take duam. I don't know whether you die where people went duam. Or say now you command me the duam. But what I know, say, if you now you take, bring Jezebel, come back when we send Isaac, I ask you of um, uh, Mary Magdalene, I ask you of conquering Princess Tina, come out to bring uh, my madam, Princess Jen. Eh? Why? See what I won't talk. I don't know where you do them. I don't know who you send. I don't know how you take the side. Or say you did busy, somebody has come to them on your behalf. Ba -ba -ba. Carry this same woman. Return him. Bring my princess Jen come back. This I ask you. Through Christ our Lord. Oh Lord. Amen. <laughs> hey, hey. One more important prayer. <sighs> Baba. You know, since a snake, I snake come out, you see. Because say they know their house. Baba. Make anywhere where they day. Make the day there. Forget say they ever get house. Say you get where they pay rent or where they build house. Until oh, I reach house. Relax, chop, bath. Before they go ever remember to come back. Or if they don't come back today, tomorrow they're good. This we pray through Christ our Lord. 
Amen. My mother been to go to go for it, but I don't pray for Madame. Pray for snaking. But this country, Amen. When are we fixing our wedding? Uh, what wedding? Have you suddenly gone deaf? Or are you having ear problems? I said when are we fixing our wedding? A bit too early to um, to be talking about a wedding now and get into the very tedious um, details of planning a wedding, especially after um, the ordeal with the kidnappers. I'm thinking that you know, take some time off and you know, relax a little. What's that supposed to mean? You tell me, what's the meaning of that? Can we talk about this when I return? Please. I hope you are not playing games with me. Why would I want to do that? You want a wedding? We'll have to sit down and talk and plan, right? Because I return, we'll talk about it, I promise you. Huh? You're not playing games with me. You do not know what you've gotten yourself into. Jane, wherever you are, I speak life into you. You will not die. Oh no. Nothing will ever happen to you until I am satisfied with the level of pain and agony I must have caused you. So shall it be. Your Majesty, you have to do something. 
Woman, I don't want to talk about this. Please, give me a break. I should give you a break. Does it occur to you that we are talking about our son here? Our only child. The heir apparent to this throne. He is old enough to take care of himself. Are you saying he should go ahead and marry that girl? We that demon? We made a very good choice for him. But he turned us down. Please, I don't want to talk about your son's foolishness again. Fine. If that is all you want to say about this matter, no problem. But I can assure you that my son will not marry that witch. He will not marry her. As I don't want you. I want you, but you wouldn't listen to me. I never saw it coming. I never knew she would go this far. I never knew. That bitch has really beaten more than she can shoot. She sold me out to the police. She killed my comrades. Nah, hey guy. You only die once. Let's end this thing once and for all. No, no. you to know that I am not happy nor in support of what my son is doing. But I want to assure you that the police are seriously searching for your daughter and she will be found soon. The gentleness of a tigress should not be termed for weakness. Why accuse a man you know has no hand in what is happening to your daughter? Uh, Baba, I, I don't want anyone to suspect me. No one is going to suspect you. Have you forgotten I prepared the child in such a way no one will be willing to look for her? Have you? But he said the police are looking for her and she will soon be found. Woman. Worry no more. Go home. No one will see her until you have destroyed her. Thank you very much, Mama. I will forever be grateful and loyal to you. If you dare see what in my eyes see. Hey. <laughs> mm. What did your eyes see? You said she did be forgotten. If now you use your eyes see this one now to tell me it could be problem, you could just be very, very stingy to tell person's story. Sam, you don't rush me. What happened? What did you see? Queen, come here with some boys today. So because the queen came here with some boys, that is why you're shouting as if something happened. What then? What, what happened? Not the ordinary coming. If I taste her come, now come when we say she come here with two boys, come push your madam Tina. Come out. You're joking, right? How? 
No, look my face. I, I resemble you, banana. I, I, I resemble you, basket mouth. I be you get anyhow. I resemble you, ay. Or this face now resemble you, uh, MC banana mouth. Eh? This is this serious. You talk. This is serious. Hey, I missed. I missed this free show. Nobody just say you miss. If you day here, nobody the come out now be the problem. What? Like the pattern of pushing. I think the boys is a big push. They are push out. He push up. Hey, I missed. I missed. <laughs> Don't worry. I will see you at the meeting, okay? And we'll talk about it. No problem. Father! What exactly is going on? What is happening? What is going on? And what arrant nonsense are you talking about? Why would your wife go to my own house to throw dinner out of my house? Father, my house, we don't live in this palace with you. No, we don't. Why would your wife do a thing like that? Because you twist your mouth backwards. How dare you talk to me like that? How dare you refer to your mother, the queen of this land, as your wife? So why have you suddenly lost respect and regard for your parents and the throne? Father, what you have just said right now has nothing to do with what I am talking about. However, tell your wife to go find that woman and bring her back to me. Else, Father, you see this kingdom. <laughs> you see this your kingdom will be too small to contain you and I. I tell you. What is going on? Huh? Where have I gone wrong? Why did you give me this type of child as the heir to the throne of this kingdom? Why? Hey, Ekweme. God, I say, make I can't thank you. I say, make I can't thank you for what you do for me. I be to say, you know the answer prayer. But with this one, what you do so? You don't show me, say, you not talking, I do, you be. Eh? I won't thank you as you make queen. Come, come out that wicked queen, uh, uh, Madam Tina. Beat and come out for, for Morga House. Eh? God, I beg as they beat and come out so. May they beat my Madam to come back. Mm -mm. May they carry my Madam come back. I beg. Eh? Now you make I carry this better chicken. You may ask no need to hold chicken and come around more. So if you praise the big man for small one, what you do? You can go do another one. Now half of my salary be this so. I squeeze and squeeze and see, make I buy this big fowl. Come give you for the big thing where they do. If they do the fowl, so you go see, send a marriage man. God, I beg if you make my madam ever come back house. Now, big cow, I go carry come greet you. <laughs> my son, I did not go reach cow. I talk to the one when God no go use punish me later. I go buy better goat. Better goat. Come give you. Eh? Make you. I you to manage this one. Now like gradually, you the manager. In Jesus Christ's name, amen. Hey. hey! Manage this one, just chop him. Chop him, where, where? This one overgrow, oh no, more, no, no, because too much pepper. Why is he not picking my call? Your Majesty, I have done that which you refused to do. How dare you bring this all to me? This all to you? How do you mean? Who authorized you to go and kick that girl out of that house? Your Majesty, do I need anyone to authorize me to do what I'm supposed to do? Your stupid act gave your useless son the impetus to come to my palace and insult me. Did you come here today? I forbid you from doing anything of such again in this palace without my consent. Ebubedike, Arana Zongwa, Baba Hum, Baba Hum, Papa God, not waiting here, you talk with this. Why be saying that today, when I carry myself gently, with better fowl? Come your house, come give you. And you can still be the same today 
Let this devilish woman come back to this house, Mpa. God, you, you take her now, you no good. Eh? Get the kind of people where you go see, you go to see that hair fire, they go straight. Madam, Madam, no verse, no beer, they talk give. And I just talk why I won't talk give another person. Eh? No verse, me. <laughs> Why do you say every time you just the, the fight with you go make you laugh? Aye. Cosmos. So you are this scared of her? Who? Yeah? Who 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 is she? Huh? What's your name? Tell me one 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 more You 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 don't know see that woman be very bad. Mm. Bad person. I know. You get people you go see you just know she's threats. Mm. Na na high five they go they don't need they don't need to. I know I know. But Cosmos. The way I'm looking at you, from the very angle I'm looking at you, you'll soon become jobless. Hmm? Soon, very soon, you become jobless. Jude, Jude, from the angle when me and my look you, this angle soon, soon, you will become driveless. Madam, you see what? Are you deaf? If you ask me such stupid question again, I will deal with you. But I'm not that gate! No, no, please, see me. Are you deaf? Do you want to see the other side of me? What's the problem? My friend, unlock the gates! Why are you asking him to lock the gate? My friend, lock the gates. Oh, go and get house, see me, I go lock the gates. I said lock! You want to go out? Fine, go. Open the gate, I'm, I'm going out. Let me to the side. about my daughter's whereabouts? Honestly, Mama, I am tired of our police force. They keep saying they're investigating the matter. Yet, no result. As far as I'm concerned, the police does not exist. Until they prove me wrong. Then what do we do? What? You, you know, it, it sounds funny and strange that we have no useful information on our whereabouts. I might be quiet over this. But that does not mean that I'm not working hard to find my daughter. I just wonder where she could be and who is responsible for her disappearance. Whoever it may be, we have me to contend with when the time comes. Tina, why are you like this? Why are you doing what? Do you want me to miss my appointment? Does it look like I care? You don't care? I have told you what I have been told me about this conversation. Just open the damn gate, let me go. I should open the gate as what? As your gate man? Do I look like your gate man? Huh? Listen, do not insult me. When you're ready to go out, you go. Tina, you're being unfair. Tina, this is not how you and I started. You are being unfair. Okay, please stop making noise. Just do the need for and give me a wedding date. That's all I want to hear. Give me a wedding date. Please. You keep looking, searching on the outside. When you have what you need and want. Your Majesty, the prince is in a very serious trouble. Trouble? What kind of trouble? 
Is my son all right? Has anything happened to him? Your Majesty, Tina. Tina is at the verge of destroying the life of the prince. I would suggest you do something about it before it becomes too late. But what exactly are you saying? My queen, you won't believe that the prince is like a slave in his own house. Do you really know what you're talking about? Are you sure? I am very sure. Your Majesty, the situation is more serious than you can ever imagine right now. You can go see things for yourself. You are going nowhere. Your Majesty, you don't seem to understand what I'm talking about here. I don't care. If they like, they should go ahead and kill themselves. You are not going there. Your Majesty, why are you doing this? Why are you being out of your own child? Your son? No true blood of mine will disrespect me the way he did. Are you now saying that Prince is not your biological child? Don't put words in my mouth. Or is there something you need to tell me? Mercy you will have. Okay? No one will kill you. I assure you that. See? Who beat you? Did you say they see that you're a crocodile tears? Look. By the time we are done with you, you will see that mercy you ask for. Stupid girl. I said, quiet! <laughs> now, listen. Listen! <laughs> we were asked to kill you. Do you understand that? But because you have pleaded for mercy, we will not kill you. Yes? But, we'll leave you here to your faith. We are nice, right? At least, we are nice guys. Are we not? <laughs> guys? Let's get off here. No, no, no. Can't, we can't just live like that. What? Now, can you imagine now? We are asked to do this. Can't bear this girl. When we take her this girl, why are you talking like that? Now, can't bear this girl. Listen. I know what I'm doing, okay? Let's live here. I didn't go to the end. I know what I'm doing. I said, let's live here. Nah, Ken, now you are cooking a drum, man. I'm going to the last order, guys. Man, this is not true. I don't understand what you were saying on the phone. What, what, what actually happened? Mr. Eric, she's no more here. Who? I don't get you. No more here. Who is no more here? No one can tell. She just disappeared. Are you out of your mind? What are you saying? Did she vanish? Is she a ghost? Mr. Eric, I can't lie to you. It's against my profession. What is your problem? Are you out of your mind? Are you insane? I like, kept someone under your care and you're telling me she disappeared? No! I don't... You must do something about this. What is your problem? Are you really a medical doctor? <laughs> that one. That one. Uh, uh, he hasn't seen anything yet. <laughs> Baby, don't you trust me? Calm down. Listen, by the time I am done with him, he will regret ever knowing me. Yes, now. Ah, uh ah, -uh, now what for you? Now you did talk this one. Don't mind him, Jerry. Yes. 
Oh, you hurt me now. Eh? Don't you know what I can do? Eh? <laughs> Madam, do you realize I'm here? What do you realize I'm here? Come on, get off, get off the dial phone. Eh? Me, me this one. Get off the phone! Can you get off the phone? Let me call you back, okay? I have them. Let me call you. Get! Get off! Get off the phone! What is it? Get, get off what the is phone. it? Get off the phone! What is this? What's the meaning of that? Freaking phone! Why are you here? But why are you here? Why why did you not sleep in the master's bedroom? Why why are you here in the guest room? Why, what are you doing here? Frank, I have told you. If you are looking for a sex mate, one cheap hall to warm your bed, go out there and get one! All right, fine, I get that. Am I not going to eat this morning? Why do I not have my meal on the dining table? If you want a wife who would make you breakfast, act like a responsible man and do the need for you. You know what to do. And please, don't even do that again. I know what to do. What am I supposed to do that I'm not doing? Huh? I'm talking to you. Why are you a witch? Really, what kind of what kind of a witch are you? The one you brought up with yourself. Clearly. I think I agree with you on that because I'm in trouble. Oh yes. <laughs> I am in big trouble. I'm in a big mess. And babe, before I was rudely interrupted. Perfect. I hope no traces or any form of mistake. Madam, we don't do half big job. We are professionals. We do not leave any trace when we do our job. Meet me at our usual spot for your balance. I like the sound. Thanks a lot. Leave it to you soon. Wow. That's more like it, boy. <laughs> um. You need to call Aya right now. Uh -huh. Let him be fast. Okay. You need to leave here immediately. Yeah, dude, what's up? Yo, wanna move now? Sometimes what you really need is right in front of you, but you don't see it. Sometimes what you really want is right there in front of you, but you fail to see it. You think the grass is greener on the outside. I fail to see. Did you break my kitchen door? Frank, I am talking to you. Did you break my kitchen door? <sighs>
Why are you standing there staring at me like that? What is the problem? Your Majesty, please forgive me. In any way I must have sinned against you. Please, I am truly sorry. Forgive me. What is the problem? Is there anything wrong with you? Your Majesty, our son, my son, your son. If he is the reason you are kneeling before me, then stand up and leave my presence. Because I don't think I can help you in any way. In that case, you have to be ready to bury me today. I'm going to. What do you think you're doing? Stop it! Will you stop it? Stop it! Your Majesty, please, I love you. Go to my son. I love you. Go to my son. I love you. Go to my son. I want to go to my son. I want to go to my son. I want to go to my son. Is that why you want to kill yourself? I beg you, let me go to my son. I beg you. I beg you because I beg you because I love you. I can see you're not afraid of me. What brought you to my house and who gave you my address? I see you've grown wings. But you know what? I predict. How dare you talk to me in that manner? Listen, let this be the last time you go to my husband's house or his parents' house to discuss me. <laughs> Do I make myself clear? <laughs> now, what husband are you talking about? Are you married? Well, you can answer that yourself. That's a rhetorical question. Like I said, the next time you cross my path, you will not leave to tell the story. that does not want to see or follow the truth. Your Majesty, I know Frank and Sam has not been the good child we wanted him to be. But that should not make us turn our backs completely on him. Have you not heard the saying? Cut off your left hand if it is going to lead you to hell. Your Majesty, are you not saying our own son will lead us to hell? Forcing him to do the right thing might make me do something I may regret tomorrow. No, I just do not mean to regret anything. No one cuts his journey to a very important place on the road. We have to keep going until we get to our destination. We cannot leave our child just like that. We cannot abandon him. We have to keep moving, keep talking to him, keep doing the need for until he becomes a better person. I know he is not for us. Father, I know that I have wronged you. I know that I'm not worthy of your forgiveness, Father. But as a prodigal son, Father, I have come to seek you. Get out of my palace! Get out! Father, I understand how you feel. And whatever judgment you choose to pass on me would be right, Dad. Are you conversant with the saying, cut off your left hand if it is going to lead you to sin? And another one said, 
forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those that trespassed against us. I have trespassed against you, Father. Please, forgive me. You will not marry that girl. Daddy. I am in love with this girl, Daddy. Allow me to marry a woman that, that my heart beats for. Frank, why don't you want to listen to us, your parents? Huh? What becomes of your real wife, Jane, when she comes back? I strongly believe that she's still alive and that she will come back to you. I hear you, Father. But what if she doesn't? What if she's dead? I still wonder why my son is bent on my daughter. Children of today find it very difficult to listen to words of wisdom. If I insist on not attending this wedding as his father, what will people say? Your Majesty, you have done your best as his father. Do what is expected of you and leave him to his fate. I thought you were sleeping. How can I sleep? shoot someone on their wedding day no matter their differences no matter what the problem is who could have done this your majesty this society is telling something i don't know but your majesty does the prince have a son have problem with anybody were you not there at the hospital when i asked him the same question and he said no Woman, please, I am not the right person to ask all these questions. Excuse me. Huh? You guys are wonderful. You can say that again. Miss Pat, you really want to hear the truth? This is what we do for a living. This is who we are. We deliver whenever we are called upon. Obviously. I mean, you're simply the best. <laughs> Thank you, madam. We are happy that you are satisfied with our job. So, do you have our balance? Sure. Sure. Yeah. So let's go. All right, guys. I have to run along. Wait, why something in a hurry? I don't want any form of suspicion. Alright. Thank you guys. Two other for you. One le que le quego. Le que le quego. Le que le quego. Nigga. This is Cashmere. Sit it down for Cashmere. 
How much is our bill? 700. 700. Bring more drinks. You can't money. There is money to spend. <laughs> Uh, this time around, let go stand. My king, behind every ugly situation is found an ugly factor. Your son is under a serious spell. Yes. The girl that cast the spell on him wanted him dead. She wanted to kill him so that he would die without getting married if he fails to marry her. And who is this girl? Your Majesty, the hunter should not concern himself with how the antelope jumps over the grasses, but he should concern himself how to aim and shoot. You should be concerned with what to do to avert the situation on ground. Because the very girl, the girl in question, is the same girl that your son would have married some days ago. Tell me what to do, Anyadike. I will give you something which you will add in his food. If he eats the food, that thing will neutralize the charm that he has already taken into his system. That is that. And he will be free. You mean my son ate something that makes him behave this way? Yes. Eats the food before the end of tomorrow. Leave the rest for the cops. Your Majesty, how did Anya Dick know all this? What kind of question is that? Your Majesty, I just want us to be sure of what we are doing. Because all this way has not said anything. According to him, the gods have not spoken. They have finally spoken to him. Please, let's do what they are asking of us. Your Majesty, I don't want us to make further mistakes. I just want us to be careful. Please, please, don't push it. The gods are more than us. The wicked must not go unpunished. Why don't you be plain so I can understand you? Time to avenge the death of our comrades. It's now. I have been waiting patiently for this day. I can't wait to look part in the eyes and judge.
She tell you she's coming today. Yeah. I see her for church. She tell me say she dey come. You have serious malaria. Malaria, that's your problem. Make sure you keep this to yourself. Do not say it to anybody before you land yourself into trouble. Do you understand me? Cosmos. Uh, sir. Why were you earlier today? Uh, yeah. I could pray. You want to pray? Listen, I don't need to mind this gate properly. Do you hear me? No one is allowed to get into this premises except, of course, for my parents, the king and the queen, and then my wife, Mrs. Jane. Yes, sir. Am I clear? Very lucky. Very lucky. You see, no fear. I know God where they serve for heaven. Eh? Where I learn how to pray, now for children. Where I go pray, now for can come. Oh, presently where they worship Nana. Oh, oh, oh. Who you go ask? How you say you die like for Moses, die like for Ask me and Moses for Bible. At the same prayer school we go. I shut down for you. Lucky, me and my men You asked me to kidnap and eliminate Tina. Because she took over her best friend's husband. This is 
fact, I don't even know what to say. I am completely confused. My dear, you have really fought a big war with that. But we thank the gods for saving your life. So happy to be alive to tell the story. You must take me to that hotel and save your life in the forest. Yeah. It deserves to be rewarded. Okay, I'll do just that. But first, please, please, I would love to go and see my mother. Because I know she must be heartbroken after my disappearance. You're absolutely right. You need to go and see her as soon as possible. We will go with you. Yeah. Thank you, Nikki. Thank you, Nikki. It's okay. You're welcome back. Thank you. Um, we lost the young lady. Huh? You mean Pat is dead? Yes, sir. Uh, she's dead. Uh, unfortunately, she died before we, we arrived. Okay. But I want to specifically thank you for putting a call across to us. Thank you so much. We appreciate it. As a matter of fact, you're a good neighbor and a good Nigerian as well. A good citizen for that matter. Thank you so much. Officer, immediately I heard the noise from her apartment. I sensed trouble. I knew something was wrong. I decided to call you people. Oh, I, I didn't know she would be dead before you people were so Oh, it's, it's a pity. It's a pity we lost her. But once again, I want to thank you. Thank you so well for putting the call across to us. I appreciate that, okay? This is what we tell every Nigerian citizen. Call us on phone when something like this happens. I appreciate you so well. Meanwhile, um, if any need arises for us to call at the station, I will put the call across to you, okay? Thank you. I will answer. Okay. Officer? Sir. Put them inside the vehicle. Sir. Oh yeah. Move inside the vehicle. Move inside. Stupid criminal. Jump inside. Now to jump inside. Keep going. Jump inside. Jump inside. Beatrice, 
<laughs> you did all this to your own biological daughter. No, you went. She is not my biological daughter. It is. What are you talking about? What is wrong with you? Oh, uh, Carlos. Please don't say this. Don't say this kind of things to me. What's going on? Yes. She's not my biological daughter. What is wrong with you? Her mother died while giving birth to her. Jane, I met your father marry me before he died. He willed everything he had to you. He left one hundred and. Fifty million naira in an account for you. Hey, Beatrice. He left houses. And even the land that practice for you. Well, Lola from Lola from Lola. Beatrice, you are evil. So you perpetrated all of this. And then you have the guts to accuse my own son, the prince of this land, that he was using your daughter for rituals. It went so. You don't deserve to leave. Which? I forgot about why. Yeah, but why? Mother, when you told me father left nothing for us, you told me he died a poor man. And his people wanted you dead. Which is why she never allowed me to go visit them. That's what you told me. Hey, that was because I, I never wanted you to know the truth. I wanted you dead so that I could take over the money and the properties. Die. Which die? <sighs> so you're not your mother? Yes. So die. Please tell me. me. Tell me. Where, where, Who am I? Who are my people? Where am I from? Where am I from? What's my room? Calm down. I'm from you. What the hell? I know that I have hurt you that I haven't lived up to your expectations, Ada. I have hurt you through my actions. But I have invited you here today to apologize to you. And to tell you that I am truly sorry. For now I know better. Daddy, please forgive. 
I want to be in your arms again as your son, Dad, for I have nowhere else to go. Please, let the hurt go and find it in your heart to forgive me. I understand. Life is like a journey into the unknown. And we must live it one day at a time. I'm glad we have learned the lesson. Every time that I treated you less than you actually are, I am sorry. James, please forgive me. I have come to realize that you're not just my wife, but a gift to me. I've come to that realization, but I just hope it's not too late. Find it in your heart to forgive. For I know no other person that I intend to do this journey. To get on this journey with Papa Fred. No one else is fit, no one else qualifies for other you, God. If you just forgive me, I promise to be a better man right in front of you. If you just forgive me and give me another chance, I promise to do right by you. Please, my love. Princess. My daughter. Please forgive him. He said you were going to do everything I asked you to do for me. You made that promise to me. I beg you to please forgive me. For my sake, forgive him. You know he didn't act on his own. He's my daughter. He's my daughter. He's a better husband now. What do you think? that I do not want to live the rest of my life without you.